Okay, we're good. Oh my god, it's planks. <laughs> that's too easy. That's too easy, yeah. In real life, yeah, that's right. That's right. That beats my story. <laughs> if that's my wife, I'm not here. <laughs> yeah. That's the funny thing about being married for 30 some odd years. It, it, it's like the one thing you do learn is there is a reason that the word um, mood is doom spelled backwards. <laughs> <laughs> She is, her job is terrible, and I'm a, I'm, you know, certainly have my trying moments, and then throw that in the mix, and it's, it's hell with a lid off sometimes, you know. It's like, <laughs> <laughs> but good Lord, uh, so. Okay. Um, well, I'll do this. I was, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of fumbling around. I think I've got time for uh, another song. Um, and so I will do another song. It's in my contract. It's the kind of guy I am, you know. When you book this cruise ship, you get another song. That's right. So anyways, thank you all uh, for, for making this uh, a, a cool thing for me. I, I've, uh, for years. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, with that thanks comes uh, <laughs> A song about uh, a poor, me uh, poor mental health and uh, late night radio. So. I had a period in my life where, where things went really peculiar. They went sideways, as they say. But uh, I was recovering after a study in the uh, county timeout pen, and um, <laughs> I was sitting. I, I was. I had enormous problems with insomnia. Um, but the weird thing is, w when you when you go long periods without sleep, you have these odd, fragmented thoughts that sometimes make great song lyrics. So um, <laughs> there's that silver lining. See, you know, it's, like, it's, like, it's not half empty; it's half assed. No. <laughs> anyway, hey, please feel free to use that. <laughs> anyway, so I was sitting on the porch, and it was about 174 degrees outside, and I couldn't sleep, and my life's snoring away like a racehorse, and, uh, but I loved her even more for it. So, uh, but uh, the radio guy came on, and back when you still had radio guys, and uh, he said, uh, today's celebrity birthdays are uh, probably Roy Orbison and a bunch of people, and His Holiness, the Dalai Lama of Tibet, and uh, I knew things were going to be Ote. <laughs> It's the Dalai Lama's birthday, and I'm sitting on the porch. It's a July with a vengeance, and all the trees and grass are scorched. And through the door I hear some beautiful song about the rain. I recall from long ago when radio was still my friend. And I've learned that I'm not crazy, just precisely not myself. From a five-day stay in the torrid zones of Tri-County Mental Health As I return to normal, thoughts and words buzz around like gnats Nothing seems that real to me except my wife and cats And this intense German man in tweed He jots down all my fears He writes, a corpse amused by dying Salvation in arrears and he drums his fingers on the desk and he scribbles out reports. Addicted to the process, bored with the results. Lesser hands are reaching out to God, equal parts of reverence and dread. Fearing neither darkness or the light, sleepless in a week of unmade beds. Not a single star that I can see. February returns to May and June. This is sure a slow night in the sky. Wasn't there supposed to be a moon? This is the Dalai Lama's birthday. I 
was a hoping for a moon. In my neighborhood, there are churches fighting sin. There are Baptists, Mormon, Methodists, and good old Presbyterians. As the days fly by like low clouds, you wonder where they went. All these men that would be God still smile and claim their 10%. And they shake where there's comfort in the shade. With God as my co-pilot, I'm car sick and afraid. Cause <laughs> their hands are reaching out to God, equal parts of reverence and dread. Fear neither darkness or the light, sleepless in a week of unmade beds. Not a single star that I can see. February returns to May and June. This is sure a slow night in the sky. Wasn't there supposed to be a moon? This is the Dalai Lama's birthday. I was hoping for a moon. I remember that night. It was 25 years ago, but I remember it. Because I was hot. And I was tired. How tired, you might ask. Well, I was. Too tired for spiritual fitness, too burned down for the fire the witness from every icon daddy that was foisted on us from Shanghai Shake to Epam and Nanda's brother goes to a diner waiter, screams him a phone, tries to call him some favors, nobody home and it's a dog eat dog, smoke him if you got him, eat all like if you start summoning up the bottom and this alligator, alligator, snap your teeth, there isn't gonna be no dang relief, there is laughter in the belfry singing in the law, the Pope's on vacation, the devil gone saw, there is a happy hour calling, I can smell the fumes, gonna clean up hell. Gonna burn the broom and uh, I know that he knew that we knew that she knew that they knew that we thought that they were Republican bag boys Shoot toys of the ecclesiastical working class poor boys It's the Dalai Lama's birthday I was a hoping for a moon It's the Dalai Lama's birthday Wasn't there supposed to be a moon